There it is. Today, we're going to be asking, should you watch Hulu's miniseries, Dope Sick? This eight-part series tells the story of the opioid crisis that was unleashed in the USA by Purdue Pharma when they released the painkiller OxyContin. This story follows three main plot lines. The first follows two lawyers who want to file a case against Purdue Pharma for falsely claiming their drug is non-addictive and is killing people. The second follows Richard Sackler, whose family runs Purdue Pharma, how he distributed OxyContin to the United States, and how easy it is to manipulate the FDA and the people in government. The third story follows Dr. Phoenix, who is played by Michael Keaton, and the pharmaceutical sales representatives. He works in a small mining town, and after the constant pressure from the sales reps, begins to prescribe his patients OxyContin before succumbing to the drug as well. It's crazy to see how the opioid crisis got out of control with this drug. This case takes many, many years and the timeline jumps to them fighting this case over all the years. They did every dirty tactic in the book. They tried to drown them in paperwork, they played with the wording on the label, bribed members of the FDA. It was insane. Richard Sackler was the man that you absolutely hated in this. Talk about a doppelganger to Joaquin Phoenix, though. I mean, I had to look it up to see if they were related. They're not. When someone of influence came to combat the Sackler family, you would see these backdoor deals happen, and said threat would now be working for Purdue Pharma, and drop whatever case they had. Crooked much? The way Purdue Pharma would just hold these competitions between sales reps to push the drug even further, it really shined a light on how all of these big pharma companies work. It went so far that a previous lawyer had tried to bring this company down before, but got introduced to Rudy Giuliani, who was the mayor of New York at the time, and you could just tell that Purdue Pharma was all up in his pockets. Michael Keaton is the standout for me. You see his whole journey when a salesman is sent by Purdue Pharma to sell him OxyContin. He just won Best Actor in a Miniseries at this year's Golden Globe, so his acting speaks for itself here. I mean, I'll have to admit that it took me a long time to actually watch this series because I knew how much it was going to make me angry. So if you do have Hulu or know somebody that has Hulu, put it on the to watch list. So have you seen this show? What did you think about it? Let us know in the comments below and like always, like, subscribe and tell your friends and we will see you in the next one.